Welcome to MusicMover.com. Today I want to talk about what makes a hit record. What does it take to have a hit record on your hands? Is there any real formula? Not really. Is it coincidence? Is it luck? Is it skill? Pretty much all of that. Now for me, to have a hit record, it's got to be something that people can relate to, something that is catchy, and it doesn't have to be an up-tempo pop song to be catchy, but it could be anything. Something people relate to, something that is catchy, something that is well-crafted, well-written, well-produced. And you might not even know that you have a hit record on your hands. I've heard tons of stories of artists saying, yeah, you know, this record just went platinum and we had no idea it was going to be a hit. We did it in like two days and that was it. But sometimes people know. Sometimes you just know that this is a song that's gonna do it. But just because you have a potential hit record doesn't mean it's gonna become a hit record. You gotta have the right tools in place. You gotta have the right pieces of the puzzle and put them all together and it takes timing. It's a lot of stuff involved. It's not always easy. Sometimes the song just has to get to the right people they can break the song or that can get it to the right people to get more play on radio and satellite radio and all those other things it takes a lot you might have a great song but if no one hears it it can never be a hit song because it didn't get out there like it was supposed to a lot of you might have hit songs that you don't even know about just sitting there and you can't get it to break and get it out there because you don't have the right connections so basically you want to try to do it, make sure you have a well-crafted song. Written well, put a little heart into it, but like I said, sometimes the song just might flow out of you. You might have a song done in an hour sometimes and it becomes a hit. Something simple, but it's still catchy, still makes people feel a certain way or want to dance, things like that. Now, you got to have the right things though. Like I said, you got to have the right team behind you that can push this song it doesn't just magically happen you got to get it to the right person that can let the right people hear it you got to get it to the right dj then that dj can push it through whatever resources they have and then boom you have a hit but you got to know people to do this you got to get it out there so what can you do to try to make this happen you got to have the right team behind you no matter what you got to have people that believe in you because if everyone is not on board and if your whole team doesn't think that it's a hit record it's probably not going to make it everyone's got to have in their heart that this is the song we got to get out there and push it push it to radio start going to more festivals and workshops and meet and greets with industry people that could possibly help you in the future then once you get to know these certain people if you feel like you have a hit record on on your hands let them listen to it call them be like look I got this song, it's catchy, I think you could do something. But you gotta get out and meet people, it just doesn't happen. Rarely will it happen that you have a, a hit that is just local and it's just being played on college radio in your local area. I mean, you never know, it could spread somewhere. But if you want, to, want it to happen for sure and faster, you gotta know people and you gotta get it out to them. You gotta do that. And don't send stuff unsolicited, which means don't just send it out with asking someone first. If you met someone that could potentially help you in the future to get your record out there, call them or send them an email first and be like, look, I have this song I desperately want you to hear. I think it could go somewhere. And if they agree, send it. Don't just send it unsolicited. That's like spam. So to have this hit record, you got to have good play on whether it be terrestrial radio, college radio, satellite radio, internet radio, streaming all that good stuff. You got to have good marketing behind it. You got to get it to the right people. You got to have good promotion behind it. You got to start doing shows. You should have a good video behind it on YouTube. And like I've said before, you don't need a million dollars to shoot a decent video. And that's what helps get songs out there. Because when people see the video, it gets them more attached to the song. And that happened to me before. I didn't like a song at first. Then I saw the video and it kind of made me like it because of the visuals and what's going on. It told the story or whatever. So try to get a video, even if it's just a simple lyric video. Something out there just to help. 
it's not easy and it's a, it's just a lot of luck hard work timing and of course a great song so keep that in mind now if you like this video i'm going to ask you to please share it like it if you haven't subscribed yet click the button get notifications and they'll let you know whenever a new video comes out now like i always say down below the video in the description there's a bunch of links that can help you out help your career to become a better musician band artist whatever check below lots of stuff down there great information leave a comment i'd like to hear from you what do you think what 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 makes a hit record for you what what do you need to do do you feel like you have one on your hands let me know i'd love to hear about it love to hear your story i thank you for watching the video and i will talk to you soon Thank you.